As I pulled up, Joe greeted me. It was actually nice. It seems strange. Uh, um, do, 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 sorry. Sorry, that's me thinking. Maybe Joe has some information. Hey, what's up, man? I got some information, buddy. Oh, yeah? On what? Hey, I'll tell you after the show. Come on, let's go inside real quick, all right? Or maybe something else was up. You unlock this door with a key of dumb luck. Beyond it is another dimension. A dimension of worthless noise. A dimension of idiocracy. You're moving in a land of both mm. smart and dumb are the same thing. Mediocrity and lame are the ceiling. You've just crossed over into the Texans Talk With Texans Zone. Why are the walls like bloody red? Can't believe it. Damn. Oh, you ready, Nick, for to do the show? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Hey. You like what I did with the place? What the heck happened? That's uh, that's just bat battle. Uh, what is it called? Battle red. Battle red. Yeah. Groovy. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, so what's up? Not much, man. How you doing? Oh, pretty good. Didn't we shake hands already? Yeah, what the heck? So let's do it again. Yeah. Anyways, uh, <laughs> welcome to Texans. Talk, Talk with, with Texans. Texans. And uh, I'm Joe Cool the Greaser. And, and I'm Nick C. Rogers. We got a clue, and we'll tell you after the, <laughs> after the show what the clue is. <laughs> All right. Okay, well, let, let's hear about the Texans. They're going to the Super Bowl, huh? Uh, let's see, why not? What the heck? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> No, uh, did, did you watch a game this past Sunday? Yeah, I watched it. You did? <laughs> yeah, they beat down the Bengals or the, Bengals, the, whatever you the want. The Bengals, Bengals. Bengals, Bengals. Yeah, um, from what I, yeah, um, from what I heard, um, uh, from what I heard, Andy Dalton had a uh, had a bad game that night. Oh, did he? Yeah, poor redhead. <laughs> you know. You know what? He was also called the Red Rifle. Yeah. Well. Yeah. It, the red, the red Rifle, because J.J. Watt called him that. Mm -hmm. Remember that movie, uh, Christmas Story? Yeah, yeah. You shoot, shoot your eye out. out. You'll shoot so your there you go. Out, yeah, <laughs> yeah uh, the score was 10-6, uh, by the way. And uh, not, in, not in that, uh, not in that uh, Texas fans, uh, Brian Hart went down for the uh, concussion in the third quarter. And yeah. he got replaced no other than T.J. Yates. You know who he is, right? I didn't know they had T.J. Yates. I thought they let him go. The, well, well, they're trading him. Yeah, they're trading him to uh, to the Patriots, I think. For what, like a hundred dollars cash and uh, nah, a football or nah, something? No, for uh, future uh, draft picks, I think. Oh yeah. But but Hoyer went down, and TJ uh, came he came to play. He flew in, huh? Yes, he did. <laughs> and you know what a coincidence? Three years ago, when TJ was with us, in his rookie season beat the Bengals in the playoffs. Did you know that? Oh yeah, yeah, I know. We, we're always being in the Bengals. Yeah, so, so I'm happy. Are you happy? Oh man, I'm f I'm real happy. I'm like super happy. Texas fans, are you happy? I know I am. Finally, right? Anyway, so what else we got going on? Oh, uh, we got going on uh, for for the, for the upcoming game. Yeah. Oh, we're playing the Jets. Oh, the Jets. <laughs> New York Jets, that is, folks. Oh, <laughs> uh, and um. You know our former quarterback Brian, uh, no, not Brian, Ryan Fitzpatrick. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he's gonna be playing Sunday. The beard part too, huh? The beard. That's right. Yeah. Anyways. All right, so um, that's what's going on. Um, go for a win, uh, number two. Number two. Trying to get back. To, trying to get back to uh, five hundred. Trying to get back to basics. There you go. Basics, the fundamentals, all of that. And get and go to the playoffs too, maybe. That can happen. Hey, I'm up. sure it's gonna happen. Just do it. What is that? Oh, I'm well, just going with going with the flow. Going with the flow. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, you know what? Remember my prediction? If just start winning games by the end of the season, it should be at, at eleven and five. Eleven and five. Yeah. Mhm. Mm well, they gotta win every every stinking game. That's I think right. I said ten and six. I still think eleven and five is possible. Yeah. It might be, <laughs> you know, but you never know. 
That's true. Anyway, any, anyways, we got anything else? Yeah, um, my I say I got my five keys. Oh, okay, let's go. All right, five keys. All right, starting at number one. Uh, control the clock. Game clock overall. Offense got to stay on the field, and to give yeah, that, that's just bottom line. Bottom line. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> uh, number two. Uh, T.J. Yates is at the quarterback, and he's he's uh, replacing uh, Brian Hoyer. So, but but it's it's only for this week, right? Is he gonna probably play this week? He might. I, my my sources have not yet to confirm. Yeah, yeah, he got some good sources. Check them out. Yeah. So, uh, so that's so that's what's going on, Texas fans. Uh, T.J. Yates will be starting quarterback for uh, Sunday's game, of course. That was number two. Uh, number three. Number three it would be the defense. Defense uh, did a heck of a job uh, in the last, last week's game against the Bengals. You know what? Let's keep it up. There you go. See? And uh, uh, number four. Four, coaching. Special teams did a pretty good job. Give, give props to uh, Brian. Uh, give, I'm sorry. Give props to, um, to the coach. Uh, what's his name? Bill O'Brien. Yeah, Bill O'Brien. Yeah. I'm sorry, I just can't get those names. I always get those names mixed up. Bill O'Brien, oh. Brian, Brian, Ryan, Ryan. Know what I mean? <laughs> Fitzpatrick, Fitzpatrick. Ryan, Ryan. What the heck, folks? Mallet, Hallett. Yeah. And number five, last but not least. Matt Chubb. <laughs> no, no. Number five, at least, just win. Yeah, do that. Devil sign. No. Oh, no. Uh, sorry, that's the. Uh, just uh, win. That's why we can get a flush. Uh, I mean, a slushy. <laughs> if not, then we'll have to do a flushy. <laughs> Ooh, not good, not good. Anyways, um, I feel like I'm forgetting something. Uh, what is that, Joe? Nah, we gotta go. I think that's it, right? That's the end of the show. Yeah. Now, uh, yeah, we we gotta go because, uh, you know. Yeah, we got yeah. We gotta go, uh, folks. Um, man over here got an inside tip of what's going what's going down, so we gotta find out. So tune in next time or next week and talk with Texans. I'm Nixie Rogers, and I'm Joe Cole Greaser. Tune in or else. Peace. So I got to sleep, and Texans Raider got some questions to answer. Oh, he does. Yeah, he does. He knows where this damn terrace is. Oh, does he? Yeah. Uh, well, one way, there's one way to find out, huh? Yeah. By beating the hell out of him. Why? Even if it means death. Joe, no. You just can't be that way. No, I'm just kidding. You know, you know I wanted her to fly. You know me. I didn't like it. Why don't we have to use my truck and gas on this hunch? Also, did he just want to rough up Texas Invader some more? Or does he know something that I don't know? That he knows that I don't know? Or what he knows? Ah, my head. Throw up the I'm so side confused. Him, no. Even though he, he beat us down on everything. You don't remember that? About, I was right about that. You'd side with the devil, wouldn't you? Hell no. <laughs> yeah. Hell well, no. We'll see. Hello, Joe. I have a funny feeling we've been here before. We have, you fuckers. Come on, open up. I know you're in there. Now I'm breaking the damn door in with your head. <laughs> oh yeah? Come in. You know why we're here, right? Good afternoon. Welcome to my lair. Now what do you want? Don't give me that crap. You know where he's at. The terrorists. I know you know information about them. 
I don't have no questions for you. You're lucky I don't beat the crap out of you right now. Joe. You come no, here. No, bull crap. Threaten me in my lair? And where's your damn minion? Where's he at? Hey, what are you doing over there? Get over here! Run, minion, run! He's running. I'm at no. Wait! Okay. So, nice night, isn't it? Wait! God dang it, get over here! Stop, get your ass over here! I'm still alive. Wanna bet? Nick, you're not the you're not that type like that boss Joe. You know, you know, I don't have many friends, but you, my number one minion, is number two. Let's just get the record straight. Understood. Can I ask you a question? Oh, yeah. I have a skin condition. Every time I take a shower, my skin dries up. Well, just use lotion, buddy. Thanks. I will, Nick. I will. You know, you and I, we're very much alike. But together, together, we will conquer the world. Oh, yeah. But you... For the record, I'm the only one I trust. As lonely as the universe. You know, I don't have many friends. I have millions. And that's it. Together, we can grow. And as we grow, ah. It was at that time at 12.010 and 15 seconds. Oh hell, he just said 12.010. Let me take over the narration. It was at that time that we all knew that Joe just wanted revenge. And he was a little cuckoo too. What the hell, Joe? What did you do that for? Man, they weren't talking, so I had to show them. Man, Chase and Vader was about to, about to tell me about the terrorists before you hit him. Okay. I have a million. Well, did you kill him? You got him? You killed him? What? What's that? imagination. <laughs> it was at that time that Joe decided he needed to save his little gizmo buddy. All he needed was Van Dam. The fathers, I'll cover you. His guns. Some uh, smokes. And his signature Joe Cool Glasses.
anybody's in there, I'm cheating. What the hell's over here? Oh, I guess it's time to open it up. What the hell's this? Oh, I guess it was nothing. It must have just been. You're an alien? <laughs> Yes, Nick, aren't we all aliens? <laughs> Since the beginning of time, man has always been a Neanderthal, even after evolution. Fighting for minuscule things such as land, teens, and territories that aren't even theirs. You tried to kill us! But did I? Huh? Was I successful? No, not exactly. That was rhetorical, you fool. But you know what? You have fueled my ambitions to go higher. Higher than some mere bullock show on the YouTubes. Yes, my fine feather friend. I'm going big. <laughs> you can say I'm going global. Huh? A little slow on the intake, aren't we? Yes. Well, in plain English, Let's just say, it's world domination, my friend. I won't let you! Really? You'd shoot yourself? <laughs> you fool! Nightmare. Oh gosh. Did we win? Go save the girl. It's done. Oh. Oh, 